Hello world, Lopangalamu here, Hip Hop Live SA. Today we're in Nautlip, and our guest today is none other than Mo Denaina. Ili caught up with him to actually find out more about his musical journey from where he began to right where he is. And of course, his future prospects. He's won seven the Royal Awards from Nigeria. He's won three Channel O Music Awards. And he's won, he's also won the three World Hip Hop Awards. He's got seven studio albums and five mixtapes. So that is so much for just one man. Check this out. Yo, SA, that's a homeboy, Ely. Today, episode, we got our homie, Mode 9. Modo. Yes, yes. How are you doing? I'm oh, great, man. That's good, man. Great to have you, man. Rocks, man. I'm like overlooking, overlooking the whole city. Joe Berg. Joe Berg. Interviewing. The name Mode 9. Yeah. Where does the name come from? Oh, my God. <laughs> it's been a while. Same question, man. <laughs> okay, back in the days when I was in school. Yeah. So a chick uh, needed a calculation to be done yeah. and she didn't know how to do it on a calculator. So I helped her to change it to standard form. Mm. It was, it was, instead of saying uh, a, a hundred, you just say 10 yeah. raised to the power 2. Yeah. Now if you want to say 0 0.01 is like 10 raised to the power minus yeah, 2. Yeah. So you can actually do that on your calculator. calculator yeah. So I actually set her calculator on standard form. Yeah. I just changed it. So I, I forgot to set it back. So she saw, she saw me the next day and she was like, yo, what did you do to my doing? Yeah, yeah. And I was like, oh, sorry. And I set it back. Then she just called, came back again and was like, how did you set it back? I said, okay, to set it, you have to press mode. To set it back to normal, you have to press mode. Mode? Nine. That's how That's where the name came from. And the hip hop. How did you fall in love with hip hop? <sighs> yeah. My brother, now, uh, my, my big brother came back home. This is how he just changed totally switched yeah. he came back home with a record he came back home i remember the day he came back home with a record. i was like what you get from he said friend borrowed him yeah. and it was curtis blow Ooh. he played it i was really small i heard that and i was just like that's it this is what, what i, I want. want to do because he was like he was like rapping throughout they had this part aj scratch where his dj was like scratching like like so i took our turntables then that was not a scratch yeah. and i just totally tried to imitate the imitate DJ what he's doing i almost bought the record Ooh. but you know it's a learning process yeah. from there i started trying to look for rap mm -hmm. i was always looking for rap i never really saw it looking until much later when i grew up i started seeing stuff on tv, yeah, on TV. and then one day i just felt i can do this let me just write some yeah, little it. rap. And it was hard for me to write at first because I could freestyle. Yeah. But when it comes to writing, it was hard. Just them, yeah. It was hard. So I had to just, for a while, I just took a break and then I started back Start, again. Yeah, yeah. And I was like, fuck it. Whoa. I'm going to start writing. Right. <laughs> so I, I just started writing bars and they were kind of weak, but everybody around me I'm liked them. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was a king. In the land of the blind, the one eyed man is king. king. <laughs> so and I wasn't that good though. Hip hop, man, like. The state of hip hop back in Nigeria and now. Uh, Any growth? Uh, it's like there's this uh, microorganism called the amoeba. Okay. You know, it has no definite shape. You know, it's kind of like uh, an amoeba because I can see there's growth in this aspect. Oh. Social, me social media has pushed it a certain way that you can actually promote yourself, your own, your own music, put it out there, it out the there the and then the you world. can yeah. get invited to shows in Europe or what, what not and everything. But By then at the media. end of the day, yeah. back then, I think people were more serious with the art form in Nigeria, I'm talking about. Yeah, yeah. They were more serious with the art form of hip hop. You know, but right now it's bigger, there's money involved, money. there's endorsements, there's everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the truth is, like this generation, they only concentrate mostly about like it's a money thing to them. Yeah. Right? yeah if you're not balling, if you're not on rims, if you're the eye style, doesn't if you're not, you know, if you're not, it's not doing it, man. You know the rap, you know. He <laughs> says you're not doing it, but from where we came, we came out from, from that different cloth where you just had to have have skills. Just like yeah, yeah. and also like in, I'm talking about Nigeria right Nigeria, now. Yes, yes, yes. Nigerians, they, they have this mentality, uh, they can only be one. Like a guy, a young guy coming up, he just wants to listen to only one. one. Yeah. The other guys are whack. What? Yeah, yeah just one. This, this is the king, you know? Whereas back in the day, we had Red Man, Eric Sermon. Yeah, we yeah, had yeah. Uh, Wu-Tang Clan, we had Nas, we had Nas, we had Big. We had so many people, and then we had people who were collectors. If you say yeah. you're a hip-hop head, and you're not a collector, you're you not a hip-hop head. You, you have to... 
I'm shout out to that guy. Shout out to that. I'm a collector, so I, yeah. I know hip hop. And then people just feel like, oh, Mode 9, he probably only listens to old stuff. No. I actually listen to the new stuff that comes out. Like, uh, there's this new guy called Afro. He's a new young guy. You guys are going to hear of this guy pretty soon. He's a, he's a American American dude. dude. Yeah. He, he's big, like, big. He's like 17. Oh. Like, this guy is dope. He's just like Afro, Joey Badass, um, J. Cole. All these are these are the guys that are gonna save hip hop yeah. to a to a little extent. Drake, because Drake can rap, yeah, and then rap. Kendrick. Kendrick is always there. So these are the guys that we are all looking up to. Like these are the guys that are gonna save hip hop. Yeah, yeah. Because the stuff that I hear now, it's not as if it's not good. Like if I'm in the club, I just want to wild out. Yeah. Uh, in the I can't album. listen yeah. to an album from the beginning to end. I say, boom. Shh. Shh. You can't. I can't listen to an album from beginning to end. But to uh, like, I'm not saying I don't like some of it. Some of it. Some of it. Yeah. Some of it is really cool though. Huh? Money day. And like, you can also make money yeah. by just staying true. Do what you do. See MF Doom. MF Doom. KMD. From back in the day. He became a bum, a wino on the streets. And then he started putting out music. This was, this was late 90s, early 2000s. was just putting out stuff. And then his fan base grew, the Iron Mask. Wow. He even came over to South Africa a couple of times, man. You know, I, I heard that uh, his father is from Zimbabwe. Zimbabwe. Yeah, so he used to call Mischief to speak. Mischief. Oh, yeah, rest in peace. RMP mischief. mischief, yeah. He used to call Mischief to yeah. speak to his dad in language, you know. So, you know, people like that, MF Doom, they've been all over the world. The, well, la the major we, labels are running after him. They want to sign him. But he's like, nah, I don't need him, man. I have money, man. Yeah, yeah. And just because, it's like, MF Doom has money, but you don't see him with chains and, you know, yeah, yeah. with whips in the car. He's just, uh, he's just a backpacking hip-hop mind, dude. And he knows he's, he's up for what he wants. And he knows what his fans want. And his fans, when he goes out for tour, the place is packed. Um, Jedi Mind Tricks. Yeah, was a yeah, tour. yeah, they did the tour, Europe tour. You need to see how the, the whole place the was get packed. packed. People still rest in peace, Sean Price. Appreciate the real hip hop. Sean Price. Yeah, they brought Sean Price out, man. It was madness. Wow. So wow. yeah, we can talk about hip hop right, from here till to next to tomorrow, man. Because hip hop is a is a is a very it's a big deal now. We have corporate corporate uh, investment. They're investing in big yeah. money and. They see hip hop a certain way. Yeah. Like I said, I sit down with people that are trying to do that. Right. Hip hop should speak to me. You should, I should relate to what you're saying. Yes. Where are you from? But the people, but the people, uh, people just. You listen to somebody's album and you don't know nothing about nothing. it. What you find out at the end of the album is that he has money, he has girls, <laughs> he has a gun, he yeah. can be dangerous, he can shoot you, and he has court cases. Hey, that's, and that's all you find out about the person, but. Doesn't tell about the struggle. Don't, like the struggle, what yeah. happened when you were young, you know, yeah. how you grew up, how you, how you, you know, broke into the game and everything. Like, model, yeah. I, I, I did a, I did a, I started a project with a DJ Papercut. Oh, Papercut, uh -huh. yeah, 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 I know, I know. You know, even though the, the project, we didn't release it, but we recorded like five songs. Mm -hmm. You know, I think he still has it. I have the, the recordings okay. too, you know, but this was years ago. Yeah. And on that song, I talked about my trip with Joe Berg. Anybody who listens to that will just know because yeah. I, I talked about the people that I met. You know, and that was then, and then now I'm coming after like seven years. Really? The last time I came here was seven years. Ooh. So my trip here, I've actually learned far more because I like I stayed like a month here. Oh. I came here on the third of November, and this is like the twenty seventh. So it's almost the month. Oh, so I'm actually, you know, the last time that I came, I stayed like a week. Oh. The other one, uh, I think, the longest was a week. A week. The other one was three days or so. Here four times, this is my fourth time. Oh, and this is the longest I've stayed, and I, like, I get I have that full understanding. I love it, I love Joe Berg, man. I yeah. love I love it, man. Shout out to DJ Hammer, we did some work, yeah, yeah. You know, Yo, before we talk about more work, we had, a, we had to go to break now, yes, Take yes. A breather, <sighs> Feel flow mode nine, Joe Egg City, Lim Shakes. See you after the break, yes, yes. I'm a i i 
Man, it's still hot, Moro. Yes, yes. Proper. Yeah. Why it was still hot, man? Can you give us a proper freestyle before we continue with that? A freestyle? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. Off the bat, whenever I walk by, people duff their caps. They say, Moro, man, you must be all that. But these days, everybody want to rap. I'm just sitting back in the jack, and I'm like, is that what they call rap? Yes, bro. <laughs> That's whack. Can I curse? If I can curse, I'll just say that shit is whack because these guys, they're so careful not to get my back. Sometimes they get my back with a rusty knife. They were like Brutus when they stabbed Julius Caesar. Modan is one of the best. You, you just see the money, you don't touch it. You just talk about it, you have no money for studio time. You guys are whack trying to mention my name, Mode 9. Anytime you say that name, you better smile. And Mode 9, the stitch in time, will never save you from Mode 9. Whoa! <laughs> Africa! We got the legendary Mode 9. That was kind of whack though, but so. Whoa! <laughs> it was whack. Yeah, it was. Is it? It's just a, a rubbish freestyle. Uh, Mode 9, uh, what makes you different from any other MC or rap in Africa? Because my pen, yeah. like they'll say, man, I'm, I'm very meticulous with the pen. Yeah. Very, like, my pen game is different from most people because I put, like, so much thought into it. Yeah, yeah. I don't just go to the go studio. To studio and, like, like, whenever you take me to, uh, invite me to the studio and yeah. you just say, hey, here's a beat, here's a just beat. write something. Yeah. I don't like it because it doesn't, you know, make you write your best, your best material. You, take you have time. to have to take your time and think about it. But then again, I can still do that. If I have yeah, to do it, I'll still do it. Yeah, you yeah. understand? Still come up with something good. But if you want me to come up with my best work, just send me the beat, and I just sit down and I think. I might even do it in one day. You know, it wow. doesn't. It doesn't mean I just go take three weeks. Three right? weeks. Yeah, no, no. I could do it that same day and send. Just it to want you. something that makes sense. You know, people. But I have to be in that zone yeah. where I can just sit down and write. Right. So the pen, my pen game. Like I always been saying it, my pen game is dope. Yeah. And then I do a lot of research. People just feel like I just sit down and write something. Uh, you have to check what you're writing. You can't make some mistake. mistake. Yeah, if you yeah. make it. If make mistakes, it's going to get hard. forever. It's gonna haunt you. Yeah, yeah. So um, I say it's my pen, pen game, game, you know. Like the freestyle thing, back in the day, I used to be really good at it. But as my pen game got better, yeah, it affected my freestyle because I started freestyling freestyle. less. Oh, yeah. But whenever I do live shows, I always put a little bit of freestyle. Like yesterday night, the show, yeah. there was a little bit of freestyle yeah. and everything. I told them to play the Egyptian beat because oh. I know the girls like, you know, the Egyptian beat. Oh, you. Mm -hmm. da, 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 da. So I did some raga. Yeah, yeah. I, like, yeah, I used to be a dancehall artist before. <laughs> you? Yeah. Yes, wow. and what that's another thing that makes me different yeah. is that I can actually do some raga uh, toasting, you know, yeah, that yeah, dance yeah, all yeah, thing. Yeah, yeah. I can actually do it, and I'm quite—I won't say I'm perfect, but I'm um, okay. Yeah, but I yeah. can do it. I can do it, but it's more like a UK guy doing UK. it. Oh, it's yeah, not yeah. like a Jamaican. I'm not from Jamaica, Jamaica, but I was brought up in the UK, and I still have ties to my yeah. UK people. I have Jamaican friends, yeah. and I hear them talk all the time. Even yeah. though they say, "Hey, yo, man." What? So we're not happy. We're not. We're not comfortable with <laughs> yeah, yeah, people yeah. that are not Jamaican trying to talk like talk Jamaican, Jamaican. But you know, but whatever, man. It's yeah. whatever. It's just music, and yeah, I'm, I'm versatile with it. And I borrow from everywhere. Like coming to South Africa and listening to the way people talk people and talk, everything. Yeah. I ask them, what, do, what does "ne" mean? Mm. And they're like, no. But people say at the end of every sentence yeah, sometimes. So yeah. it's kind of like you know, mm. like Nigerians. They say, oh, why are you coming? Oh, oh you know, oh, actually, what does that mean? They say that O just means it's just something that you just put at the end of a Oh yeah, yeah just yeah. like that. So it's 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 you can borrow from anywhere. Oh yeah. And there are no rules that say you can't borrow. Exactly. Like Jay Z. Jay Z yeah, borrow yeah. some UK slang, Scooby Doo, sneakers. Wow. He said that on one of his tracks. I've been schooled, guys. <laughs> so yeah, you yeah. can borrow like like me, I borrow from I'm versatile, that's why I pay attention. You have to pay attention to your surroundings, things happening. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, yeah, yeah, yeah. new slangs and everything. That's why I can do a little bit of dance hall, do my rap, rap. thing, but I don't see. Talking about music, 
uh, with so many new talented MCs or rappers at the moment that I'll mention a few from Ice Prince, you yeah. aka yeah. Kaspa, uh, Davido. You still Davido think is no rapper, man? Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> singing these things. Do you still think they are they are, they are trashy artists in Af Africa like you used to say? Pregnant, like African artists doesn't focus more on radical content. They just. Do you know what? Yeah. Like back in the day, we had uh, people like um, Shout T. Yeah. Do the hum, T hum. Come on, do the hum, T hum. Yeah. It wasn't any real serious. I could split atoms, blah, 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 blah. It wasn't, you see, the world, for the world to, you know, to exist, for us to exist, there has to be the yin and the yang to bring yeah. the forces of the world together. Shout you to understand? Yeah. There has yeah, to be yeah. that and this. Yeah. There have to be those people that are creating yeah. for the people who just want to dance. Yeah, exactly. You know, me and Ice Prince, we actually did a song. Yeah, 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 yeah. We did yeah, the yeah, song, yeah. and it was kind of like on a raga tip. Right, like, yeah. we just, yeah, us saying like, yo, man, what are we going to talk about, man? About. Let's just make it different. Let's not make it Let's have rap. fun. Let's have fun. Mm. So, it, everybody can't be a serious, oh, exactly. rap, 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 rap. Yeah. Like me, I started off doing dance hall, dance so hall. I don't even know where I was at. You say, keep it real. If, if you want me to keep it real, I have to go back to my dance hall. And I did a song with uh, Ice Prince, you know, that we did the dance hall feel. Yeah. Uh, and that was pretty dope. People liked it. They loved it actually. And they were like, yo, man, you should do more of this. More. But I do what my heart tells me to do. Like right now, my, my heart tells me to rap, even okay. though I still got some dance hall bars. Is it? I keep some of those, man. You want to hear some? Before you go to the break, let's just have some of them. Before we get to the break, you go ahead some dance hall bars before you're gonna watch Mode 9 featuring Ice Prince and Mr. 2K. I see, but check this out first. Fill in the girl with the light blue jumper. Miss, give me your number. Turn around, show me your dumper. She know what no man yam her like the pumper. I came, I saw, I conquer her. Chuck nobody when no play Willy Wonka. Come to her. So I humped her thunder. When she a walking, be a girl a dagger in no time for talking, no time for gawking. Mm. Take her to the hotel room, play honeymoon. She can be the bride, I be the groom. One like a witch, ride my broom till I hide and the kite and I can be kissing the moon. Zoom, bada bing, bada boom, boom, mancini, the boom, boom. Whoa, SA, we're going to the break. <laughs> Hip hop life, peace. <laughs> boom, 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 boom. Da da na. Hey, I, oh, I, oh, na, 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 I, I, oh, na, 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 sprints, that's a bad mountain. You ready now? Hey, I, boom. Me hear you say, booyaka, booyaka, with the guns I spray. No bad man, no come my way. Me hear you say, booyaka, booyaka, with the songs I play. Only for food is born my day. I see, I see a lot of them, a lot of them, they want me there. I see a lot of them pretending to be my friend I'm in a deal with no yes man Man I'm in a fake friends Not for them I switch up Not for them I follow trends uh, I see them scheming on my ends After I clock them They beg to make amends The evil men do We leave next in a noose Cause when you got no use They be cutting you loose Never trust a man ready with an excuse You could be the next who slaughtered in the lion's den I love my friends But I keep an eye on them Some of them I move like a duppy We not rely on them Enemy enemy No need to spy on them, but if they want war with us, we are gonna ride on them. Trust any big given a murky. Been doing this some time, I'm near perfect. Full circle, no matter how you work it. Finish where you start, that's completing the circuit. Booyaka, booyaka, with the guns I spray. No bad man, no come my way. Me hear you say, Booyaka, booyaka, with the songs I play. Only for food is born my day. I see, I see a lot of them, a lot of them, the ones me there. I see a lot of them pretending to be my friend Listen, they disappeared when I was down out on Honda Now I'm popping, they be looking for my number Let's hook up, Never. what a bomba, bomba. Yaga, you already know sha Coming back when all things are kosher Farms in on Twitter like this man can flow sha But I ain't looking for closure So I free them, ask me for don't know Deliver no go breed them Eyes at the back of my head, so I see them There are snakes in the garden, not eat them Them a fussy run way, can we not need them Don't watch them boy, not wanna weed them Still, man's not big on trusting Them watch me, after that they throw me in the dustbin Now they wanna put me on the track, pay for the busting Don't chat to me, my PA handles the Costing. Booyaka, booyaka, with the guns I spray. No bad man, no come my way. Me hear you say, booyaka, booyaka, with the songs I spray. Oh, we are back from the break. Out of his time.
We love rap now. But yeah, you want some? Yeah, yeah. Rap! Like my South African people, man. I love you guys so much, man. They're like, yo, Mode 9, man, you're a dope rapper, ain't it? <laughs> say, yeah, you're a dope rapper, man. I'm like, yeah, man, check this out. Super villain laughter. The brave get captured. Bones get fractured. Rappers are so backwards. Bastards. Better than who? Your camp booty. None of y'all out rap the 2002 me. Ooh wee. Talk less of trying to battle the new me. Yeah. I'm a vet, y'all new head. Rooney to step to me. Y'all bow down, Nilo. It's mode nine, baby. Rap superhero. In the top ten, I'm number nine. Raise the power zero. Know your indices. Moto been indie since the paradigm shifted. I'm gifted. One in a million chosen. I'm Hulk Hogan. Tearing my clothes, posing. I'm posing a threat to those opposing. I'm cold and my flow's frozen. Bagging extra O's and I'm grinding, getting my G on. Tell a label be gone. I'm enjoying my freedom. I'm eons, beyond. All you peons. Bro! Yeah, bro. That's Ooh. what it is, man. That's hot, man. Future plans. What Future are you plans, man. Yeah, man. Like, I have my hands in different pots. Yeah. Like, um,. Let's talk about South African features first. Uh, features, yeah. yeah. I, I, did, I did a song with a South African female artist, but it's not done yet. But we shot a video. Yeah. Her name is Erica. Oh. And yeah, I'm working with DJ Hammer. Cape Town. Yeah, Cape Town, but he's now in Joburg. Joburg yeah. We've been doing stuff. We did like four songs. Wow. And we shot one video. And we're actually talking about some stuff that we're going to do. Uh, like, I'm not actually making it hippity hip hop. Yeah, yeah. You know, I actually did a song that was actually a, a house track. Whoa! Yeah. Welcome to South Africa. <laughs> <laughs> like I, I go around listen to like I heard some one old was it a quite old song in the club and everybody went crazy. I'm crazy. like, what? <laughs> <laughs> Sounded nice, That's man. I just took out my Africa. phone. Yeah. Uh, the Sound Hound. I was like, I need to know who this is. A sound yeah. Hounded. Yeah. And I just looked and I saw the name and I just kept the name. I was yeah, like, yeah. I'm gonna go check it out, check download it, out, it yeah, and listen, listen to it. To it. Yeah, it's a different vibe. It's all about music. Yeah, if the yeah. music is good, yeah. To me, it's not about what the music is. It is. Either it is good or bad. Or bad. Not the genre. Yeah. If you can sing, if you're a rapper and you can sing, sing. back in you the hear day, it, Curtis you hear it, sang. Yeah. Don't you love America? <laughs> he sang. So there's a, a lot of people. Ah, oh, man, a rapper don't sing. Can't sing. I can't sing. That's why I'm not singing. Yeah. If I could sing, trust me, I'll be singing. Yeah. So for all those guys that ah, oh, yeah, 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 singing, I don't. Just let it go, man. It's just music, man. At the end of the day. Yeah. And then. Fortune Messina. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Fortune. I actually did a feature with him. Oh, yeah. Yeah, him and my boy Wicked. And Andile, the shout out. Yeah. Andile. These guys are mad, man. These guys are badass rappers, man. They're actually <laughs> in the studio cooking something, man. I don't want to let the cat out the bag, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. And yeah. then his album, man, Abom Rapper number two. I see, Abom Rapper, yeah, yeah, yeah. Abom Rapper. <laughs> Abom Rapper, them bro, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a, that's dope. Like we were yeah. listening to it, and I was yeah. like, Damn. one song he had twenty rappers. Yeah, I'm super. Wow, wicked. Yeah, everybody yeah. even rest in peace. Uh, Misty, he was on it. You know, yeah. uh, was uh, this guy uh, uh, Flabba. Flabba. Oh, Flabba, on it? Flabba, yes. But, like Flabba was on the project. Everybody was on. Everybody that project, was there. But it was the legendary ones yeah. that he put on the project, and that was a, that's a real great effort. That I think that most people shout out to it. Shout out to Fortune for doing that. And most people need to just vibe with that. You know, exactly. trying. You know, I heard that hair over here is hard to push units. Nice. I mean, to, I know things are expensive. Expensive. Here. Yeah. So to do a proper promo tour promo. and everything is going to cost yeah. an arm and a leg. But I think people should just rise up. If you're the type that's always complaining about, complain about oh, the music, will do, just rise up. Go to the shops and buy Record. good yeah. music. Look yeah. for good music. You yeah. will find it. You yeah, know, yeah. stop complaining. Like, yes, there's a turn up. This thing, like, like me. No. You give me a beat and it's turn up like uh, before I came here, somebody wanted to feature me and he got money to pay and there's a turn up beat. I don't you particularly really, I'm not crazy about the beat, but I'm an MC. An MC Same can rap nine. on any beat. So I went to this, I wrote the, the bars in the car but I went to the studio and I nailed it. Yeah, that's, that's it. And you and Proverb seems like you're close, man, and your collaboration always though oh, yeah. promote and yeah. hip hop is me. Yeah, we were like, I was uh, talking to Prova, I was like, man, we should do a whole project, man, before we call That's it That's what I was about man. to ask, yeah, yeah, we should do, like, he's a very busy dude. And yeah, me, you man. know, I got an album in Germany that's coming out very soon. Yeah. You know, I got an album, two albums in Germany. I got, uh, I got like, two albums that I haven't even put out. My projects, yeah. you know, different types of projects. So I got a lot on my plate. 
Yeah. But I know I can, you know, make out time for me and Pro Burp to just be to do yeah. legendary album, some legendary Africa songs, coming so, together, so hip hop rapping, exactly. You know, yeah. and we feature these other guys. You know, we can feature them, yeah, AKA yeah. them, you know, because AKA is me, a, to me, oh, to me, to me, is dope, man. The manifest, then uh, Navio, yeah, yeah. You know, feature the our African brothers, man, brothers, that are yeah. also dope. It doesn't mean matter just because you're doing more commercial, commercial stuff. Yeah. Like, a lot of people make that mistake. They yeah, think yeah. these commercial rappers can't rap they can they some of them will whoop some underground ass I'm <laughs> telling you man like yeah. I've heard some songs like yeah. you know but they just want to do it like some of them just say okay this is what I want yeah. this is what I do I'm doing this and I'm getting this money and that's it I can't hate on anybody getting his money exactly. so we just make some music and then sell it to the people yeah, yeah. The more the merrier. Let everybody support. We're taking his fans and yeah. trying to make his fans his our fans. fans, fans and yeah. then our fans are gonna be like, oh, oh damn, these guys can really can rap. do it. And then you know everybody's gonna be happy, man. And we came to that part of the show where we're about to wrap up. Wrap Before up. we close the show, where like people can find you, like Twitter, Facebook, booking stuff. Where can they find you? Uh, I'm always on Facebook. I have like three pages, but you have to pay attention because. Two pages, if you send messages to the two pages, yeah. um, I'll definitely get them. But the other one, I might not. Yeah. The two pages are Modine, Polymath. Oh, yeah. One Polymath is spelled with the P-O-L-Y, yeah. then Math, it's F. And then one is Math, the T-H. Yeah. So it's just those two. But there's Modine Red Eye, that, I don't really go there. Okay. So the Polymaths, you can send messages to any of those two. And then on the... Twitter. Thing, Twitter is at mode nine, M O D E N I N E. I spell my name, I don't use the number nine. Yeah, yeah, mode So nine. always spell it together. Yeah. M O D E N I N E, Polymath for Facebook, yeah. M O D E N I N E yeah, yeah. for Twitter. Yeah. And then for IG, it is mode nine. I saw some dumb underscore. videos on Instagram freestyles. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Mode nine underscore Polymath for IG. So. You know, check me out, man. I, every like, I just be clowning, having fun. Yeah, you know, but this life is not always serious. So yes, yeah. sometimes I just go on IG and just clown. Clown, yeah, yeah. So yeah. It's just all fun, man. So and the video you're about to play, tell my viewers there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We shot this video in UK. Shout out to Aunt Moss. Yeah. I, I did a collaboration with a with a label in Nigeria, in Abuja, Nigeria, yeah. in the north, where okay. they love hip hop. Moss, they came through, went to London, uh, central London. We shot the video. And the video came out dope, and we actually infused a little Sister Nancy. Dun, 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 oh, yeah, yeah. Dun, 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 this man don't trouble no one. And if you trouble this man, it will be. Yeah. So we actually, the beat has Choose an element of that, and then it's just me rapping. You yeah. know, doing my thing with my Rasta head, with like Lion King. Shout out to Lion King, all the way from UK via Jamaica. He was in the video, man. Wow. Yeah, that's that's, cool. that's that's one of my really good friends in UK. So he came through, Kuron came through, Fazilion came through, and these are my Nazi dreadlock friends. Yeah. And then uh, my boy uh, Pablo, Pablo's in the video yeah. too. Like, we all just came and it just did it and one day. Boom. Yeah, yeah. We're done. Yo, I'm Ilflo underscore SA Twitter. Hip Hop Life is a Twitter and Facebook. Follow my homie MJR underscore Limshex, MoJ Pictures, Lopang. You, Olivia22, I think, I'm not sure, but yeah, follow her. <laughs> SA Africa, check the video, we are out. Peace. Never touch E yeah. on the mic. I do the cats. Pay school fees. I ride on a track at full speed. No.